So the way that your inspection period is gonna work is that once you put a property under contract, we've got an option period. That option period is gonna be the time that you're gonna be able to do inspections on the house. Because whenever you come and you look at a house, you're so excited, right? You're not worried about if there's broken windows, if the electrical works, if the roof is good. So you come in and what you are looking for is do you actually love the house. That's all you need to concentrate on when you're looking and going through a home. Now I'm going to be the one who's going to help you figure out if it's at the right price and then we're going to figure out the condition of the house and all that. And so that's what this inspection slash option period is actually for. And what you are doing is, is you are given the option to back out of this contract for absolutely any reason at all. Now you're going to pay a small fee for that, but you can back out for any reason. Let's say you walk in and you're like, man, this house smells like cheese. I hate cheese, I'm out. So that's the beauty of having this option period. Now what's gonna happen is, is you're gonna get a general inspection and you're gonna get a termite inspection. We call it a wood destroying insect inspection. And then there's always gonna be something that an inspector comes up with on a house. So don't be worried about that. If you see a whole bunch of deficiencies or something like that, don't worry. We're gonna go through and make sure there are no major items that you just can't live with or that you want fixed in the house. And so once that general inspection is done, there might be some things where an actual expert might have to come in. For instance, if there's uh, some things wrong with the roof and then, then we get the experts to come in. If there's something wrong, we'll get a bid, we'll figure out how much it is, and then we'll make the decision on do you want the seller to fix it? Do you want them to give you money off for, to, for you to make the repairs? Or do you just not wanna ask for anything at all? And then that's how that's gonna go. All right, talk to you later on the next one.